Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Modding with Whip. Right now I'm really freaking not impressed because you know what people did to my lovely mob arena that um, my team helped me make? Well, turns out it wasn't exactly totally world guarded. And you know what that means? That means some jerk face blew holes in all the walls. Can you believe that? That's why we can't have nice things for like half the time because... You know, a few people are jerks. I don't know who it is, but I'm going to freaking kill them when I find out. No, I'm not really going to kill them. I'm going to ban them six days like that person who griefed my um, guild while it was still in progress. Uh, I got their name, but I don't need a name name. So people know who you are. Jeez. Just, why is it that you see something nice and you got to break it? Like, Look at that. There's a bookshelf in the way. But the worst part is we're in the nether, okay? I got a little secret to say to you guys. You know, this server... Uh, there's a lot of data saved up, okay? And we gotta save um, space wherever we can so that it runs real smooth. Well, guess what? One of the ways we do that is log block. Yeah, it, it doesn't work in another. If you use this to your advantage, I'm gonna freaking kill you too. <laughs> but yeah, basically... If people get griefed in the nether, there is nothing we can do about it. And we've said this time and time again. Um, you know, protect your houses, protect your houses. You know, this area was world guarded because it's a friggin' uh, giant QB circly thing. It, um, I must have missed the sides. So what did they do? They went to every side they could and they freaking blew it up. I heard a bunch of explosions. There's an exploit where you can make explosions in the nether. Let's not talk about that because I don't want anyone else to blow up the arena. Because guess what? Like I said last time, the other arena, it's gone now. We can't have it back. Why is it gone? Well, if uh, if you're intuitive, you'll know that we said uh, just uh, having it um, made it so God Mode doesn't work anymore. And you know what? People who uh, donate to the server, well, they'd rather have God Mode than uh, an amazing arena. I don't blame them. I don't blame them at all. But uh, the people who made the arena plugin need to fix that. As for this arena that I made out of the kindness of my heart for people to have in play, you know what? Who the hell would break something like that? Probably some new user because you know what? I was nice and I said, work mob arena, um, come here if you want to. And they blew it up. They came in, they broke both sides. It was terrible. I'm uh, fixing it. No, it's terrible. Anyway. What's up here in the top floor of the mob arena, you're probably wondering? Well, it doesn't really matter, does it? Why did I just kick Tony Jaw? Because he's being a jerk. I'll tell you why. He's my most likely suspect right now for who blew it up. He's got absolutely no sympathy, and he's having a lot of fun saying it's creepers that blew it up. Or ghasts. Not making my day. Rule one, don't piss off the mods. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. That's not rule one at all, but it's a really good idea. Don't, you know, you expect us to help us, and then you make fun of us when stuff happens to us. That's not nice at all. Anyway, here I am just re and stoning up the outside of it. And I have a closed mob arena. Not this one, killer. I can't believe that. That's just terrible. You know, mods get grief too, I guess. And I mean, you know, precious stones, protect your house, you know, blah 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 blah. Look at this! Look what somebody did. They ran in here, broke everything. <sighs> Look. They, and then they used flint and steel to make it look like it was gassed fireballs. So I'm pretty sure it was Tony. I can't prove any of it, so the best I can do is every time he makes a jerk statement, I'm going to kick him. Because honestly, I'm no mood right now. No mood. Do you guys get grief? Seriously, like, because of precious stones, you shouldn't. I bet they broke a bunch of mob spawners. I'll have to look into that because I don't know if my warp mob arena right now um, is uh, operating at peak efficiency. Oh man, this really, really bites. 
But yeah, how I made this was all natural uh, mob spawners. I copied and pasted. If I finding out who did this, should I do you? Jim Jam. Yes. <sighs> That's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. But like I said, log block doesn't work in the nether. What does that mean? I can't roll it back. I can't find out who did it. I can't find out if it was a gas. Because I don't know, maybe there's been a major error. If you're wondering why it seems a bit laggy right now, there's literally 200 out of 200 people online. Um, it was 3.2 TPS. So we're doing great um, for being max capacity. I'm just raging right now just because, you know, I'm a mod, you know what? There's some problems I can't solve, and when I get griefed, like, that's a pain in the butt. Like, look at the extension of this, okay? Someone had to go and build pathways from each of the three areas and, and, and blow a hole in the wall. I know that's what they did for the inside, because the inside was definitely world guarded. Anyway, I finished world guarding it, and I suppose it's all open and ready for business again. Except for right freaking here. Replace all this end stone. I made it all nice and cool, and I even placed it in the nether, because I thought, you know what? It's unique. It's unique to have it in the nether, but uh, I guess, you know what? I have to... I have to be, uh just like everyone else, you know? The nether, it's it's a dangerous place. But anyway, if you were wondering, this is me when I'm not impressed. Very not impressed. But, I can fix it. <sighs> Apparently... Well, guard mm, the sides. That's a pain in the butt. Pain in the butt. Yeah, um... <sighs> Griefers, man! Why the hell did they even come on our server for their own pleasure? So, you know what? Fine! I'm gonna say, you've got one... Round one, whoever did this, but if you get me in the overworld, ho ho! <laughs> All I can say is you're going down. Because you managed to find one area where, um, we seem to be a bit deficient in protection, because we can't world, um, can't have our data protection storm system store all worlds, for goodness sakes, it's already laggy due to the amount of, uh, world we're already logging. Why can't I spawn potions anymore? Well, we had to blacklist them because people were abusing poison. Thank you. Are there still holes? And I'm not... And I'm not... Not done. No, and I'm not done. I'm gonna do this until the wall is fixed. Oh my goodness. So what else can I talk about? Like I said, griefers, like what? You, you think you're funny, aren't you? If you've got videos out there, hey, let's go grief this place. You know what? You're not fooling anybody. You're just trying to wreck fun for everyone else. and Nobody likes a fun wrecker. Nobody. A few people might, but they're trolls. And you know what? Don't feed the trolls. How about that? That's rule, like, number, what, three? pretty obvious not to like like just in real life who are your real friends you know are you gonna sure you know you can get a few laughs out of the ones that uh, you know like people that are malicious but how much value does that have in it anyway hmm riddle me that do you even know who your real friends are I'm sorry I'm getting a bit deep into this but um but literally people who just like to you know, get enjoyment out of the, um, the pain of others. There's something wrong with your heads. 
you know? They're just, they're somewhere. I can understand the fun with blowing stuff up with TNT, to a degree, you know? Come on, it's, it's TNT. Otherwise, like, Bomberman and, and other, like, games like that wouldn't be so popular. Heck, um, I got this game called Gun, where you're, like, a cowboy guy. Um, what is it? What system is that for? GameCube, I think. Anyway, yeah. And, and one of the items you get late in the game is called the Dynamite Crossbow. And the funny thing is, when you're, when you, like, you shoot people with a gun, everyone realizes it. Right? They'll, they'll take out their guns and start to shoot out in the saloon. But if you hit someone with an arrow, they won't realize they've been shot. So the dynamite crossbow is, you shoot them with an arrow, but the catch is, the arrow's got to stick a lit dynamite tight to the end. And the only one who will realize that you've just, you know, become hostile is the one that you shot. So what I do is I go into, like, the main saloon. I like, uh, you know, there's a couple people playing Dixie on the uh, piano. I'll shoot the guy that's standing there watching with a dynamite crossbow. He'll turn around, you know, pull out his gun, and then boom! The dynamite goes off, blows up him and the three people next to him. There's arms and limbs flying everywhere. Then everybody gets up and calls the posse for me, you know, murdering four people in cold blood for the sheer joy of it. Like, that, that's great, you know, but... When it comes to multiplayer games, to a certain degree, you're just a jerk. And, um, on this server, if you're a jerk to people, we take care of you. But in this case, sadly, I guess they get away with it. Whatever. You know, because this mob arena, you know, I do stuff for the majority of people. You know, I can't just tear down the arena because one or two people decide to you know, be like, hey, you know what, let's get back at FWIP. You know, what did I do to people? What did I do that was so bad? I made you a mob arena so you guys could uh, farm XP. Like, you don't need it. I thought it was a good idea. It doesn't even need people to activate. You can't even abuse it. <sighs> but what happens is this. You know, you, people who can abuse things will. That's why we can't... That's why, like, the majority of things that people, um... Might want to suggest can't happen. Because, you know, a few people just ruin it for everyone else. And that's the sad truth. Anyway. Thankfully, there isn't, uh... There isn't anything else I need to add here, I don't think. This mob arena will keep, uh, spawning things. I just, uh... Double check the glass is fine. No one else wants to help me, eh? I help everybody, but as soon as this happens, who's helping me? I mean, J4 had to leave, but. You know, it would have been nice to have him fill in a few holes. You know, what did I do except build this in the first place? And I don't even come here. I don't need it. It doesn't help me. I built it for everyone else. A couple people ruined it. Getting a bit repetitive, really. You know what? Fine. What's the cyan color? Is it, uh, and, uh, three? Is this cyan? Well, well let's, I gotta say talk. And three. Is this cyan? Because he wants his... Wants his, uh, prefix changed. I don't know if that's cyan or not. Okay. So, pex, user, Jonas, four, four, five, five. I spelled his name wrong, but just watch, Jonas. 4455, prefix, what is it, ampersand 3, yeah, gamer. There you go, Jonas. Thanks for being patient. You first wreck my mood. Anyway, that's this area, anyway, if you're wondering. Thank goodness that ZZZC, I guess, took a video while the bloody place was on fire. Why is it on fire? Anyway, yeah. Up here is the enchanting um, area. I've, you know, put explanations on it. I got them all off the wiki page. Um, you know, there's a... I'm doing a heal sign right here on my secret ender thingy. Ah, but I suppose that's it for this video of Whip fixing his mob arena. Yep, yeah, it's still up. If anybody catches who did it, tell me. <laughs> I'll get him.
Otherwise, I'll keep enjoying the XP. Thanks for watching, everybody.